keep talking, I'ma keep popping. Rocking this pip, not no robbing. Now they loving the way that I'm saucing. We superior to average, no top ten. We gon' come in and change up the topic. We playing chess, I don't check us. We moving strategic, we not moving around us. This ain't no regular. We doing numbers, I'm really ahead of ya. Ain't never heard of ya. Pull out a gang in this bitch, so you know he's superior. Huh? Yeah, bitch to the average. I ain't doing nothing average. We get it poppin' like we get it poppin' like. Welcome back to another episode of the Piff Company Podcast. It's your boy Elijah. Josh. Tay. And we on episode 59 today. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Big 5'9, you know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Yes, sir, man. We just keep on pumping these things out. You know, we had a little hiatus last week, but we was, we was, um, well, I don't know where the hell Josh was. He never pop out with us, bro. What's going on with you, man? Why you never pop out with us, bro? I'm broke, man. Gotta work. Next vlog. Josh gonna be there. He has to pop you know out. I'm, I'm gonna but... force him if I have to drag him out the house. Goddamn. <laughs> that ass. But yeah, man, we you know we content creators, baby. So yeah. you know what I'm saying. We bring in all different type of shit. You know what I'm saying. So yeah. make sure you hit that notification button. Yep. Feel me. New vlog is out now. Yeah. You know what I'm saying. Darty off the circuit. Yeah. Shout out to Real Never Fade, man. Yeah. Shout out to yo. That was it was fire. It was, it was Shout good, out bro. to them, I had man. a great they time. Put on a good, a really good event, man. Especially. For the like the price and stuff like that to yeah. get to Martha, all that everything stuff. Everything was smooth, bro. Everything was smooth. Smooth, bro. That man, was smooth. For, that was a like great you just time. said, man. Shout out, real never phase. Go yeah. check them out. You know what I'm saying? They be doing the thing out in Boston, man. Yeah, man. So, bro, for sure, for sure. But yeah, man, we got a we got a lovely show on our hands. And like my brother said, if you're new here, subscribe, man. You know what I'm saying? We just stay tuned. All right, guys. Yes, um, what we what we get into today? Let's get into some quick hits, shall we? Shall we? Let's do it. Let's do it. All right. Cool, cool, cool. All right. So, listen. Speaking of quick hits, yo, I saw this. I saw a video, um, and I'm, I, I want to play it for you guys, or if one of you guys can pull it up on the computer um, on Josh, that if link. Josh, you want to do it? Mine's a little funny right now. Um, but anyway, so I saw a video of Hunter Biden. Mm. For those of you guys who don't know, that is Joe Biden's <laughs> son. Uh, he records himself smoking crack. In like this weird like 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 sensory deprivation tank or something like that, and mm -hmm. it was literally like a month after. Look here, it go right here. It was like a month after him going to like a rehab like clinic or something like that, and basically My his dad paid for it like twenty thousand dollars. Yeah, so start that from the top. This is crazy, man. This is recent. This is recent. Is it? Re and then when I was looking it up too, look at him. He's sitting in this, sitting in the pool. Oh my goodness! Like he's just bugging out, bro. Like and smoking crack. But what my whole thing is, and he's booty hole butt naked. All right, in some weird, like I said, sensory deprivation tank. Drinking oh, beer, drinking a seltzer, to living life, and smoking doing, crack. Doing crack and drinking beer is at the rehabilitation I know crack. center. Oh, he's smoking out of a crack pipe. You don't see I didn't it. see the pipe. Let me investigate here. Investigate it, Josh. He's smoking. He's and which means, how do I know? He's <laughs> a known crack smoker. Yeah, I know he has. He has. <laughs> Yo, but what's crazy, too, is like when I was looking that up, like there's mad other videos of him smoking crack. So it's like, why do you just record yourself smoking crack? I don't know. What's he sad, hit bro? that pipe very nice. Hey, he hit yo. it, right? Yeah, he was like this. So who knows? Guys. It could be. How you know how he hit it right, Josh? You're scaring me, man. I'm watching the video, cuz. You know he hit it right, though? Look, he hit it. I might have to check on Josh more often. Look at that. You can't see it, what he's yeah, smoking. He's smoking it. Yeah, he's smoking that good stuff. I mean, that bad stuff. Don't, no, no, you don't promote crack. Hey, it could this. be either or. Listen, <laughs> I guess so. But yeah, I thought that was just wild. Like, it's just like, you, okay, even if you are a crackhead, hmm. okay, you could, okay, you're a crackhead. Why are you recording yourself? Like, yeah, that's sad, bro. That's sad. I think, I don't shit like that. I'd be thinking it's sad, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. you, that's a person's low point, you know? And he's mm -hmm. definitely had a few, you know what I'm saying, from what I've heard and shit. But damn, bro. I don't know. Hopefully, he gets that help, bro. You know what I'm saying? But For being sure. Joe Biden's son, too. Is that's like, what I'm saying. And you I, if that was my son, yourself. bro. If that was my son, bro, I'd make sure, like, bro, he's. 
He's gonna have to be like not locked down, but like locked down. Like he can't be <laughs> able to record himself. Like, smoking crack, you know what I'm saying? Until he gets his shit together, bro. He ain't got no phone, brother. Smoking crack, <laughs> like, like you, know you understand? Yeah. That's the president's son. Yeah, don't smoking look crack. That's why in the debate, Trump threw it at him, which yep. is fucked up. I mean, I was shit. so fucked up. Damn, man. <laughs> yeah. You gotta get, you gotta get the people on your side somehow, right? That didn't do fun. shit though. Yeah, huh? He didn't do shit because he's still president. Yeah. Still president. Yeah. I don't know, man. Probably That's gave so... him some sympathy. Oh, I ain't gonna lie, and... Joe. He responded good to that shit, you know, because a lot of people would have lost their cool. I don't know if you guys remember. He responded hell, like mad professional. Mm. You know, I mean, not much you could say. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I mean, that's what it's I'm a saying. Fact. A lot of people would have. <laughs> fuck you say about my son? You know what I'm saying? Like, he was like, you know. Hunter has issues. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. He just did it right. He's got issues Hunter, like many of the millions of get Americans. Get yourself right, bro. <laughs> like, my thing is, like, why crack? Why crack? You got all that money. That's why. <laughs> no. <but> like, <laughs> you got all that money to buy crack. Like, crack is usually, like, but you, a very impoverished kind of drug. You feel yeah, me? Yeah. You don't see rich people doing crack like, yo, I'm better that crack bike. No, the belly will pass that cocaine God, or well, some cocaine shit. Cocaine and crack is all the same thing, man. So it's like, you know, they they can get they hit however they want to get it. And it's crazy because even with in that into that same to that same like uh sentiment, it's like people who start off doing like like popping pills and stuff like that, it becomes like the opioids, it becomes too expensive, like after a while. And so they have to then go and get heroin. You know what I'm trying to say? Like they go basically down that the route. same shit. It's the same exact shit, but it's cheaper in a more obviously a dirtier version. So it's like kind of yeah. I feel like it's probably it depends the same who thing. your source is. You know? yeah. Amen. But for the most part, from what we know, you know what yeah. I'm saying? Just stay off the stay off the crack um, and the coke and the have, heroin. Yeah, and the pills. stick to the cannabis. Yeah, stick to the cannabis, guys. Seriously, seriously. Uh, you don't want to be no out multivitamins. Here doing crazy stuff. anything. You feel me? No. <laughs> No, no. What it was that shit called? Valiums. Oh, yeah, yeah. None, none of that, none of that, that type of stuff, man. You, you know, know, it's crazy. I got my teeth pulled. Yeah. And the doctor prescribed me some Valiums. Mm. Didn't really do anything to me. You I took think it's it? Yeah, of course I took it. He's of they course said, I, I took it. Why say it of course like that? Damn. Damn. Three teeth out of my mouth. We gotta check them. <laughs> like what? Bro, they. One I took I... one and then that shit didn't help. And then I smoked the blunt. I threw the pills out. I was yeah, like, this guy shit. Yeah, because my my teeth were still hurting, so I had to smoke a blunt, and yeah. then it was chilling. And then I was yeah, like, yo, careful with the smoking suck. blunts, though. What when if you pull your teeth because the smoke can get inf- like can infect your uh, the open yeah. thing. That's that's the one thing I heard. My systems can... used to smoke. That's a fact. <laughs> it's the smoke god over here. Y'all must have forgot yeah, who y'all yeah. talking to, man. Uh-huh. Seen, uh, scary movie. Smokey gets shot. Smoke comes yeah, out yeah, of his yeah, lungs. Yeah, yeah. That's you. <laughs> that's probably me. Nah, for sure, for sure. Um. All right. All right. All right. All right. That's a quick hit. Um. Clearly, he's getting his quick hit. Um. Yo, another thing I saw, man. This shit is kind of. This is wild because I'm actually moving to this state. Um. So the senator of Rhode Island. Shout out to Tierra Mac. Um. She filmed the video of herself twerking on a ha- in a handstand, upside down in a handstand. And might I say, Shorty was looking thick. <laughs> you got Elijah's vote, clearly. You, you got my vote. Miss <laughs> Mac. <laughs> Tierra Mac. Yo, pull up the video, Josh, man. This thing, yo. Yeah, that's crazy, right? Tierra Mac, senator of Rhode Island, is at the beach twerking in a handstand, bro. He said, vote for me. <laughs> you won't? She, that's a good promotion right there, bro. I mean, do you think this will help her get a vote? She, definitely a few. Oh, fuck yeah, you talking about. She got about. my vote, goddamn. I don't know who she running against. <laughs> <laughs> they twerking upside down on the beach? I don't think so. I don't think so. She got the qualifications I'm looking for, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but I will say this. She Dude. definitely has got a lot of back. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let's look at this video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Start this from the beginning, boy. Wow. Hey. My volume ain't working. It's all good. Wow. Oh, wow. Crazy. Shout out to Tierra Mac. That's impressive. On that, that's impressive. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, I can't do that. 
Mm, like I'm talking think, about the handstand. I don't, well, the handstand whoa, whoa, whoa. part, bro. Like that's a pretty good handstand or arm stand, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> whatever. She in it and twerking that yeah. thing and it's moving, boy. Yeah, it's moving. She relax. Thick. Thick, <laughs> thick, 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 thick. <laughs> She's thick, 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 thick. I'm about Yo, to get yourself in trouble, trouble right? Tell her, call with they. Hey, uh, how am I getting in trouble? I can't look at a video. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a voting citizen. Not, not with those kinds of comments. Your girl gonna be like, oh yeah, she thick, thick, right? She thick, 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 thick. She, she gonna be looking at your ballot like, you know what I'm saying? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> who he voting for? Nah, man. I, listen, shout out to her, but I, I mean, she's definitely been getting a lot of um, backlash. You know, yeah. like people saying like, this is why black people can't be taken seriously. And it's like, you know, and I, I get it because it's like, yeah, you are a senator. You're supposed to be the leader. What's going on? It's your boy Tay taking you to a quick commercial break. And just want to let you guys know it's a very special day. And for that, we wanted to release something special for you guys. You know what I'm saying? So we got two new colors on the way and we're restocking the fan favorite, the khaki, baby. You already know what the deal is. You know what I'm saying? So go check that out on the and go get superior to the average with your boys. Come on now. Till next time, baby. <laughs> you know, you want to be seen more professional. You're obviously supposed to, you know, leading the state you're in. Right. So it's like, you know, is twerking, like, is that a I mean, America's already the joke of the world when it comes to political shit. Yeah. You know what I mean? So fuck it. Why not? This is where we go. This is where we going down. This is the road we going down, bro. Hey, man. We Obama was our last good president. That's a fact. Shout 100%. out to Obama, man. Shout out Obama for real. You ain't see his daughters out here twerking or smoking crack. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying. Man, I don't know, man, but I think it was. Uh, sometimes you gotta be ballsy. You feel me? Shit. Sometimes you gotta do shit out of the box, man. Yeah, but yeah. That, I, I mean, think she could have done something a little in different. In a political <laughs> campaign, when they say be ballsy, that means, you know, like, hit a topic people aren't trying to talk about. Ain't nobody mm-hmm. talking about twerking Sharking. now. You feel me? She said, she got a, she's like, I got a great idea. Oh, oh man. man. You that think was... she did that by herself? Okay. No way her marketing team approved that. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody <laughs> would. She Nobody went would. on a limb, bro. Yeah. She said, this is mine. This is what we doing. <laughs> Stir up some news. Tierra Mac. Hey. Piff Company vote. You got it. You got it. <laughs> 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 oh, man. All right. What else is going on, man? What else is happening around the world? Um, <sighs> bless you. Thank bless you. you. Bless you. <clears throat> so Spain is um set to allow cannabis to be sold in uh, dispensaries and okay. pharmacies okay. this fall. Okay. So, you know, if you get a prescription from the doctor, you no longer have to just go to the dispensary. You could go to... I don't know their version of CVS or whatever. Oh, really? Like something like that? Pharmacy, yeah. Oh, they. Oh, that's deep. Actually, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Yeah. That's pretty um, cool. it's qualified conditions and must. Oh, so you have to have something that requires it, okay. obviously. So like, it's a lot more in depth than going to the dispensary. Yeah. So some of the conditions they uh, listed were sclerosis. So scoliosis scoli- no multiple sclerosis sclerosis I don't know yeah you, S-C-L-E you, 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 you butchering uh, it some forms of epilepsy and uh, to deal with side effects of chemotherapy cancer chronic pain and stuff like that mm. cool cool okay hey man well that's In dope Spain huh yeah we might be out to Spain man A little, little uh, maybe that'll be the next vlog Shit, it's gonna be an expensive vlog right there, boy. Hey, yeah, better run it up. <laughs> subscribe to the piffcompany.com. <laughs> I mean, subscribe to the piff company uh, and go to the piffcompany.com and get you some, uh, some, some, some STTA gear so you can uh, sponsor that trip. Anyway, uh, <laughs> so, so. um, okay, mm, that's shout dope. Out shout out Spain, bro. Shout out to Spain, man. Maybe that'll, that'll like. Hopefully that'll like kind of spark something here in the USA. You yeah, know, man. to see how that works out over there. You know, and then maybe this country is just slow. It's just slow. Yeah, very slow. Very very slow. So it's slow out in Maine. You say? I mean, Spain. No, like, I'm saying here in America. Wait, I was giving the go ahead for pharmacists to sell 
Okay. Yeah, saying like if they were to look at like just saying like if uh, America sees how they do it, if if it works out, you know, then maybe we'll have pharmacies like, and uh, stuff in the instead pharmacies. of like yeah, dispensaries so, just, so and so stuff. Instead of paying forty five at the, the dispensary, thing. you could get your insurance to cover some of it. Wow. I, that's my uh, understanding because you know, okay. insurance. Okay. So, yeah, yeah, I didn't understand what you're saying. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah. Insurance. Wow. Yeah. Think about that. That be that's different. Wow. That changes the game. That does change the game. I never thought about that, bro. Mm -hmm. You get prescription, you know. But then it that depending would change the on game, bro. It, of course, yeah. But it kind of depends on like what what you're gonna get though. But, but you know, are they gonna yeah. give you like because they got the capsule for bro, forms? Bro, I don't something. give a fuck if. Because I guarantee you, even if the insurance pays for it, yeah. let's say it's like a three hundred dollar ounce, yeah, they're only gonna pay half of that shit, something like that. So if I'm paying one hundred fifty, that shit better be gas. Be it like, has to be gas. Yeah, yeah. Bring me the label for this. Yeah, I gotta make sure what I'm buying. That, yeah. That's that's interesting. Like how you said it. Like how are they gonna do it? Like mm. what products would they do it towards? Products? You know, what would be covered? What's not covered? Mm. You know, that Axel. Opens a lot of Dosages, questions. Yeah. Things it's, like kind of, that. it's probably gonna start off with a, like a lot of the creams, topicals, and, uh, that makes sense. Uh, I mean, tinctures, edibles. I feel like edibles too, gummies, yeah. stuff like that. Right. And then you can you can like dose it better. You and can then once have a dose, once the flowering gets more scientifically like mapped out, they'll probably start using flour Maybe. for prescriptions. Maybe I feel like that's I feel like there's too many variables with with uh, with the flower. You know, you gotta obviously search for like the microbials in there. It can't be any bugs. It has That's to why be I a said certain. When it's mapped yeah. Out better mm -hmm. Yeah. It's a lot That's of. That's crazy though. That that. That's actually wild because I never thought about that. That'd so be... it makes you think: How's it? Is it gonna eventually be like that here, bro? What happens probably to the get dispensaries? You could probably get a pen. Yeah. Mm, recreational. You probably go there only for recreational, recreational or something yeah. like that. Yeah. Because they uh, would lose I mean, on the medical side. For sure, if you can't use your insurance, unless you can use your insurance it's there, there the too. Um, Damn, different you, business models. Yeah. You should be able to because um, some people go there with doctors. Doctor notes. Yeah. Doctor notes. But that's how, like, yeah, that's how you get the your medical card and stuff. Yeah, so. and if you have a medical card, I think your insurance pays a portion of it. Oh, I don't know about that. That's in, I don't know. They have to. You know, if if the doctor's prescribing, no, I don't think so. I think you just you just get a discount. From when I was there, like when I was at the dispensary getting this bag, like there was um, the person right in front of me. She was a medical patient, but she just got a discount and doesn't pay taxes. Basically, mm. the insurance would do that shit. <laughs> probably, probably. That's crazy. So that's definitely crazy. Yeah. So we keep you guys posted, man. Keep you guys posted. Let you know. Let us know what you guys think. If your yeah. insurance could cover your loud for the week. Would you do it? Would you get your shit right? <laughs> I need three months supply. That, 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 that insurance policy is gonna be expensive though. You gotta think about you paying month. That premium yeah. is gonna be expensive too. Yeah, to keep that in there. Yeah. Mm hmm. Crazy, crazy. We'll see how that works out. That's actually really. That's a. It's we might have to retouch on that. Like this whole yeah. that whole idea. I don't think it's gonna be that bad to be honest. Yeah. Cause my shit right now is expensive as fuck. Yeah. Like if you if I had no insurance, my medicine would cost like five hundred. Well, yeah, of course, yeah, yeah, much more than that yeah. for a one month supply. For Bro, month. what? Like just one pen alone is five hundred dollars. I think it won't be that crazy. Wow. Yeah. He just lowballed this shit out of it. Mm. I'm telling you, mm -hmm. one pen one time my insurance didn't go through. One insulin pen, four ninety five. I get a box, multiple boxes, three months supply for thirty dollars copay. Let's think about that. Mm. Right, there's gonna be something insurance. like that. Woo! Run it up, boy. He gonna be running it. All right, let's move on to our main topic today. Let's do it. Let's All do right, it, let's do it then, shall we? Um, what are we talking about today, Josh? You tell me, man. You brought this topic to us. Well, you wanted to go to it. All right. So, <laughs> main topic today is about Brittany Griner. So the White House affirms that Brittany Griner uh, is wrongfully detained after her guilty plea in Russian cannabis case. So if you guys don't know, we actually did cover this a while back, but if you guys aren't familiar, uh, Brittany Griner, she's a WNBA basketball player. She, um, uh, I don't know what team she plays for, but she also played overseas for a little bit, I think, and was, was doing some stuff like that. And um, she went to uh, Russia and this was like during like the beginning of when the war started yeah um, and basically they found a cannabis cartridge in her in her bag and so they detained her and kept her um, 
kept her there for months now at this point it's been months since she's been um, fucking ridiculous in jail i'm sorry my so, question is is like you know shit's tension is hot like why are you going over there as an american so i so she i was think playing she plays ball. Ba- plays yeah. ball over there but still like you know russia got beef with america but she's on the team she has to go do her job she's getting a million. well i don't know millions Skip but she can't get money bro yeah well now she's in jail <laughs> Yeah, and I think what I like from before, I think it was something like it could have been an accident, potentially like having it in there from before or whatever, because it wasn't Easily, like a bro. full cartridge. It was bro, an empty cartridge. I wouldn't hold against the Russians for placing it. But like, oh, she's American? Mm. She's stuck here now. Conspiracy corner. You never know. Bro. That's crazy. You never know. But this is crazy. But it, what's, what's interesting about this, you know, the new developments on this is that basically like you know obviously the american like you know the officials and stuff like that all the like you know government officials are trying to figure out how to get her back but they're thinking like does you know the fact that usa has prohibition on cannabis like the fact that it's federally illegal is that hurting their case on getting her back because it's like it's like bro she would be like same shit here it would be exactly like it's illegal in your in your country why are you trying to Free her from a crime that's illegal in yeah, your. Yeah, wouldn't be. She wouldn't be facing no ten years in our fucking. Talking about ten years, bro. Right. That's, I mean, up until like what? For a fucking years, not four, even full cart, bro. For up until five years ago, you would get the same shit here. Ten years, even five bro, years. Ago, people, they're not giving you ten, bro. There's people that are in prison right now for having like what a zip or like less. There's people in jail, but not no damn 10 years. I, I, I mean, know. there's been crazy sentences, bro. So I, I've seen a story. Someone was sentenced for like 23 years. for like, America's years. America's the last person to be talking about people in jail. Yeah. We're the, like, we we're the, the worst. Highest, but, we're the worst out of everybody rate. for it. Yeah, but they're doing it on a political stance, though, bro. You know, like you're not going to tell me there's no political backing on it. That, of course, they did it. She's American. They knew the the shit that was gonna come with it. You feel me? Yeah. Cause it's like, what do they usually do? They usually snatch up, like they'll have a um, somebody in prison here that's Russian, and mm-hmm. then they'll do a swap. A swap. It's right. kind of fucked how these things work, bro. Honestly. Yeah. <laughs> Release a spy or someone yeah, like that. Right. But it's like that's not the that's not the equivalent. It's not equivalent. So crazy. A spy is not the equivalent to a basketball player. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like they have different type of intel. Than a basketball player does, so I feel like that that's that wouldn't yeah. work in this situation. Um, although I'm sure they probably tried it, you know what I mean. Um, but it's like, damn, bro. Yeah, they, I don't know. Like, like you said, they're tra- they're trying to you know give her ten years in 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 Russian prison. prison. Uh, Who knows how that is too? God Ain't nobody man. fucking with her though. She's like seven feet tall. Goddamn. <laughs> <laughs> Russians are different, bro. Bro. I've seen so many, shit. I've seen so many videos of Russians just swimming in ice cold water with just a bottle of vodka to keep them going. Like, Damn, yo, you <laughs> they built <All> different. Right. <laughs> so look, do you guys think that this will lead to like faster cannabis reform in the USA? Like, if they, because if they're already questioning if they're, you know, if it makes sense that they're going to be, you know, if the case isn't really strong, being that you know we have it illegal here. Do you feel like there's gonna this is gonna lead to some type of reform? It should. Some type of legalization. It should, but I lost faith in this country, so God I, don't, I don't think it will. God damn, you lost faith in the country. Well, yeah, man. Damn, Josh. Bro, shit's fucked. Mm, why you say that? Everything from healthcare to our political fucking our political people. Like we had a, a guy like Trump, yeah, in, in the Oval up, Office. A lot of fucked up things. In you know what I mean? Yeah, he was li- he literally got interviewed like three or four times about grabbing someone's pussy or some shit like that. You feel me? Yeah. Like that's not something you want to see from your leader. Definitely. And now you got now you got candidates twerking. <laughs> <laughs> like you got the whole nation or well, the federal government just got rid of abortion or something yeah, like that. Bro, yeah, right. yeah. yeah like, it should be scary this shit's bro. fucked moving backwards yeah we are <laughs> definitely going backwards man damn kid just got Honestly. shot the other day from the cops mm. I forget his name bro I think it was out in Ohio yeah, all these school yeah. shootings yeah you're telling me you can get rid of abortion but you can't get rid of guns 
Well, you, I'm gonna say this right now: you definitely not getting rid of guns. There's more guns than there are Americans, um, so you're not getting rid of them. That's just not gonna happen. But you can make them illegal. But to you have. can make it harder to get as a, it a should team. be. Right? Absolutely. That so. that should be the case for sure. Um, oh, yeah, man. Yeah, man. Um, so let me ask you guys a question: If this was LeBron, do you think that it would have went down the same way? Do you think he would have been already out? I think I think they like LeBron over there. You said they would what? They like LeBron over there oh. in Russia. But like, if it was him, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I would dap I, him I, up. But like, yo, do you think he would have been dealing like with the same like circumstances here? Like, been in there nah, still? He would have been out. He would have been out. Billion Let's dollar be honest, man. Bro. Billion dollar man. It's hard to say. He would have been because their their, you know, their statuses are very different. Like. Mm. NBA, it's fucked up, but NBA players are well more known than WNBA players. Yes. He's more money. He's the face he's, of the NBA. NBA. He's more recognizable, you feel me? So, people they gonna, they people in Russia... They're they can to get him out. Yeah, people in Russia are like, yo, you got LeBron here? Get him back to the United States? He got a game to play, what yeah, the fuck? Yeah, probably. You feel me? Probably. It's different, but yeah, also, yeah. they could have been like, fuck LeBron. He's in, the, he's in jail, too. Saying, so... So I don't know. To ask I, I think it's. True, I think they would have let him go just because it's, you know, it's LeBron James. You know. I think he would have been out. But if it was like a Kyrie Irving, I think he would have stayed in jail too. Because he contra- he's so controversial and shit. Yeah. You feel me? It just depends on. I, who that's, you a good, that's a good. That's a good. That's a good. That's a good. Because now you're saying it's past just male and female. You know what I'm saying? It's past that. I think there's more things involved because yeah, if it's Kyrie, careful now. Yeah, let's let him. God right, damn! <laughs> hold up, let's yeah, pause this real quick. <laughs> yeah. Welcome back to another commercial break brought to you by the Piff Company. Just wanted to let you guys know we got some new merch, new size, new colors. Go check us out. All right, we back. My man, uh, almost almost died on us for a second. Um. Well, yeah, I like what you were saying, though. Basically, it's it's about status and not really, you know, man or female. But I definitely do think in this case, it is um, a little bit of that. There is that to that in play. Yeah. But like you said, if it maybe if it were like Kyrie Irving or like Bradley Bill or someone like lesser known, what then I feel like, yeah, it probably would be a similar situation. You know what I mean? I think it's more of that status than... Um, than than who they you know than their gender um because yeah i feel like if lebron was there he'd be he'd be get he'd, he'd be out i feel like he'd be out for sure probably would have just paid someone to he would he's a billion billion dollar man <clears throat> he he, he would have he would have figured it out now let me ask you this um if it were the uh <clears throat> like a different type of compound do you think that it would uh, it would work out? Well, like instead, that. if it were a THC, like if it were a different type of um, like THCP or like THCO or, T- or something else, if it wasn't like Delta Nine THC, do you feel like it would she would still be in jail? Well, it depends on like the status of that in Russia. True. You know what I'm saying? I don't know how it is in Russia if that's legal or not. True. But <clears throat> yeah. I don't know. And also, they probably don't give a fuck. You know, if it's THC or yeah, THO yeah. or THP, yeah. like, I don't give a fuck. You're going to jail. Yeah, they, <laughs> yeah. they probably all classify it as fucking... You know, cannabis or whatever. Like, yeah. I think I think people also take, um, take that, like, they think cops are the same everywhere. Like, they're not the same as they are in America. You feel me? Like, there's a few in America that will, are fucked up and will shoot you and shit like that. Mm-hmm. But in Russia, mo- majority of them will... Fucking beat you and just leave you there and shit like that. Mm. Like, they don't give a fuck. Mm. <clears throat> a lot of those eastern countries are police states, you know. Mm-hmm. So they're a lot more. Uh, what's the word? Active. Yeah. In their demand, you know. Yeah, right. I get what you're saying. Well, uh, hopefully, she gets free soon. Yeah. Um, and yeah. hopefully some type of reform comes with the cannabis you know with 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 obviously with the uh, with legalizing cannabis if they're already questioning if this is you know hindering her from coming back maybe we get something in play 
we'll see. We'll figure see it out. Happens. She wrote a letter to Joe Biden, and he said that he talked to her wife and was like that he's going to do the best he can to get her out, that they got some stuff in play. So we'll see what happens, man. But They got Jello Ball home. out of China. I forgot about that shit. That shit was bad, yeah. He's lucky to be out. But he was only he was stealing. He was, yeah, yeah. Still, but in China it's different. I mean, they cut your hand off. We're also not in certain a places. places. In, in certain places, <laughs> yeah. I, I'm not saying China, yeah. yeah. but yeah. certain places they cut your hand off. You steal. I think that's, that's like Saudi Arabia, Thailand. I don't know about Thailand. Uh, no, I think they're, no, I don't think Thailand. I think it's Saudi Arabia for sure. It's definitely 100 percent Saudi Arabia, but I don't know about Thailand. I don't know about uh, Thailand. I don't think it is. To say the least, though, we are here to remind the people: if you're traveling. Do some research. Yes. Know where you're traveling to. Yes. Look at the cannabis laws. Because the last thing you want to fucking them. deal with is some bullshit like that, man. Yeah. So bring her home. You know what I'm saying? Uh, this is a person. This is it's fucked up, you know? But, hey, bring her home. And uh, I hope it's soon, bro. You feel me? Yeah. Shout out to her holding it down. You know what I mean? And, um, man, we got to see some reform, bro. For fucking sure. empty half cart. God damn it. Ten years. <laughs> Fuck you talking about, bro. <laughs> so crazy world we live in, man. But all right, um, that's the main topic. And um, since we're doing things different, when you guys want to introduce this this next segment? Yeah, man. Let's get into our some would you rather's, man. Let's get into some would you rather's today. You can still introduce it. You smoke free edition. You gotta we put take that a smoke in. break, and we taking a break on the smoke today. You feel me? Is you like the wordplay? That was smooth. That was smooth. <laughs> that was smooth. I gave you that. Listen, we're we're also here to remind you guys there's nothing wrong with taking a break from smoking once in a fucking while. So here on episode fifty nine, we ain't smoking today on the smoke break. It's okay. Listen. But I guess if you still want to, go get your lighters, go yep. get your piff, go get your everything else, and join us on the smokeless smoke break. This the break. F- what, what are we gonna? Hey, know, come man. join you us said, on this one. <laughs> All right. All right. What we getting into, man? What would you say? We doing yeah. what? Some would so you rather? We doing some would you rather, man? Starting right. off nice, some crazy scenarios. Okay. So uh, the first one's calm, calm question. I like it though. All right. If you were an actor, do you think you would play the hero character or the villain better? Like, what do you think you would do a better job at playing? I think villains are easier to do, so I'd do the villain. Yeah? You do the villain? You just gotta be a piece of shit. <laughs> no. nah, I feel that. I feel that. I think I'd body a villain role, too. No bullshit. Tell me. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, I feel that. Um, the only thing about a villain is that people end up hating you, so... That's the thing. Like, I real I life. Don't, I don't... I, I'd rather be a hero. and But the also bad thing about being a hero is that if you mess up in real life... Then you're kind of like held to this standard, like, oh, aren't you supposed to be like a hero? Aren't you? You're supposed to. You're in the in their mind. You're like this shining light of a hero, you know. And then it's like, I don't know, like they catch you smoking weed or something, you know. I don't yeah, know. The, like the something. Flash just got in trouble, right? Urza Miller or some shit like he's that. He's been getting Wait, for, a couple of things. Wait, what? What? You haven't heard it? He be wild, bro. About the the Flash from the the CW show. No, bro, no, he's no, wild. From the movie. Uh, from the movie, oh, from the, the Justice, Justice League. League movie. Okay. Yeah, apparently he got a, a a woman and her child, like sixteen or some shit like that. Uh, got a restraining order against them or some shit. Mm. And he was like talking to them. Apparently, I don't he's know. bugging out, bro. I'm telling you. He's I didn't look name too up deep. Stuff pop out. He's been. I sent. I showed you guys a TikTok the other day. Dude was in the store with him and like caught him on the TikTok. And, the, and like the dude was talking about how he was like gonna knock him out. He's like, like, "Yeah, what if I knock you out?" But like, like, bro, it's mad random. Like, yo, brother. me and you both know you just play the Flash. You're not the Flash. Yeah, you ain't knocking nobody out. Yeah, that shit was funny, bro. Oh, I didn't know. I, I, yeah, I didn't hear about that. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. Well, see, that's exactly my point. And he's supposed yeah. to be a hero, but now look at him. See, what I'm saying, but he's but that, a real person. Yeah. No bullshit though. You brought up a good point of one year a villain and people like that hate you from the show. Yeah. Tariq, for example, they like people will see Tariq like, in the streets I, I, and be he's like, "He's not a villain, though. He wasn't a villain, a, bro. No one fucking liked him, though. He's you know yeah, what I'm saying? Nobody likes Huey from the Boys. But that's what I'm saying. He's it's like real villain. life people are gonna they see you and like, yeah, you know, they like that. it's gonna have um, some stain on your name. Was it Michael B. Jordan? He was a villain. It was different though. He was Every, fresh. Everybody Kim loved, was fresh as shit. Everybody loved his character. 
Kill I'm talking about like yeah. Let me think. Because like, he 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 kind of was like. He was a villain, but he had a cause for like, which ended up being like they ended up <clears throat> using his call. Like they ended up using like his cause, but with in a good way. You feel what I'm trying to say? So it's kind of like he was a villain. He did it in a messed up way, but they I, still ended up doing what he wanted to do at the end of the movie. So it just depends like, what kind of villain you play. Yeah, because if you're yeah. if we're talking about villain like. Superhero, superhero villains, like like shit like that in those type of movies, I feel like is that's better than like a villain in like a Tyler Perry movie that beats like his a wife and bang shit. Bang kind of thing. You know what I mean? You know the guy that like beats his wife and is like every movie he's the fucking abuser because he plays the role so damn fucking good. It's like real life. They probably you know people see you like and then they see with his wife like this motherfucker. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> but I'll be honest. I think I'd body a villain villain role better. Yeah, both both ways. Like, a, yeah, I think I, I, I'd, I'd rather play the hero. I just would. Mm. I have cool. I end up winning at the end of the day. Okay, okay. Um, it's not I, a comic book. It's real life. Hey man, just saying. <laughs> the hero doesn't always win in real life. Hey, we're talking about acting, man. We're talking about a movie. Oh, true, true. You feel me? All right. Um, how about this one? How about this one? What if? Your child was switched at birth, and you don't find out until ten or fifteen years later. Yeah. Uh, what's your reaction? What What would you do? Sue in the hospital. You sue in the hospital. Everything they got. I'm a million. I'm gonna use that money. I'm gonna buy a house, and I'm gonna move that family close. I'm like, listen. We're family now. You got my kid. I got your kid. All right. All right. That's a good idea. Bang. That's a good idea. But I'm definitely suing the hospital. I'm like, so you hospital. Yeah. It's not my fault I grabbed the wrong kid. They bring the kid to me, right? Yeah. I feel like Big stuff fact. like that happens a lot. <clears throat> I feel like it happens more know. often than we think. Think so? Yes. Like children getting mixed up? I think I there mean, were stories of it happening. There was a show on like ABC happened. Family a couple yeah. of years back. Like yeah. Switched at birth or some shit like yep. that. That's weird, bro. Yeah, I remember Imagine that, that shit. The, the one girl was like blonde or like in, in Puerto Rican or something like that. Not blonde. I meant Honestly, br- I only know it because my sister was watching it. I the, never really watched it. I remember. The one girl was, she was a br- uh, brunette and had, and was like Puerto Rican, but her parents were all redheads. And then the other family was... A Puerto Rican mom with a redhead daughter, and was, and wow. was yeah, it was clearly white, you know. So it's that's like crazy, yeah. Um, that's crazy. Mm-hmm. Y'all ever seen someone and they don't look nothing like their family? Um, yeah. No, not that's really. it. bro. That shit's a bugger. I'm telling you that. I'm telling you that should be bug out. Like I, I'm trying. To, I've met someone that like, it's like, bro, that's your. Like I'm talking about, like that's your family, bro. Like, <laughs> like that don't even make sense. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. look so different from their fans. So yeah, I don't know, bro. Uh, but I'll tell you this. You yeah, I think that was a great fucking plan, Josh. Honestly, I might have to bite off of it. I think that's suing. Got to sue him. Get bro, that, get that some money. millions of dollars. You know saying? Get Do that you some think money. so? You think you're getting paid yeah, for bro, that? What the fuck? Negligence. Fuck it's negligence on their end. Yeah, I guess so. That's, That's a ma- lot. But 10 years later? 10 years. Yeah, because it's not like you could tell a baby apart in the first like few years. You know, uh, it's physical features take time to develop. You Who's know, goddamn you, white baby is that? For you guys, where's the pigment? For you guys, it'd probably be a little bit more noticeable. But yeah. for me, it wouldn't. You feel me? Because if I mean, obviously, if I see a black baby, I'm gonna be like, "Yo, you think your wife is cheating?" This, this, this <laughs> didn't come from me. Going on, what was, yo, hey, hey, what you been? Hey, you feel me? What you been doing? Or ten that ten years down the line, your son's f- like. Fucking short as shit, you know. What I'm but yeah, like <laughs> you and your wife are like six, you know, six two. You feel shit, me? But your son's hair. like five eight. That would be a red flag. I'd be like, yo, wait. Why is my son we're both something? tall. You should be tall. So that's fair. I guess, yeah. But yeah, that's what I would do, man. But, <clears throat> but I, they're I, ten I would, years old, bro. Of course they're short. What are y'all talking about, man? I, I, I mean, <laughs> ten years. Yeah. All right, but like Tay was like fucking five eight, and uh, I ain't gonna lie. In the ten. fifth grade, I was five five, bro. Mm-hmm. I was I wasn't I didn't hit five feet until I was like, what, I was like fourteen. Full, me yeah. and one, I don't of my, know, me and my, one of my friends, we were literally a, an entire foot taller than every other person in our, in our grade yeah. in the fifth grade. It was insane. Yeah, 
It was actually insane. But the the kid I'm raising though would still be my son, you know. Hundred percent. Still be like, my nah, child. Ten, fifteen. Yeah, that's still, yeah, still my child. After ten years, that's still my child. You can't have him back. I was, we we could co-parent. Maybe switch and like like you said, co. That's fucked up. Less like switch. See how it works, or something. Nah. But nah. you can't have him back. I'm sorry. Enjoy my kid. Damn, that I, is I, tough. I wouldn't do that. You that me? is tough. I don't know what I would do though. But yeah, I mean, I guess I'll see if I could sue. I guess I'll see. Let's see if I can sue um, or something. I mean, your plan, like you said, uh, Tay, his plan is. Yeah, that plan was. A1, buy a house, live next ne- live next that door. That shit was A1. He thought about Man, that shit. Buy a that. big ass house. <laughs> nah, I just watched the show. Okay, okay. That was kind of like that. Ah, okay. Yeah, bread. Bread, bread. Yeah. I'm like, yo. Mm. All right. All right. Let's see this last one. All right, what's the last one, Josh? Take us home. All right. What would you guys do or how would you feel if all life on Earth got flipped? Like the big animals became the small animals and the small animals became the big animals. <sighs> so you had like pet elephants, but you had like giant dogs. Where I feel like I Or seen, giant bees. I feel like I saw a movie. <laughs> Journey to the center of the Earth or something like that. Yeah. They, they had that. Yeah. Well, second, or, or, or Shanghai No Jersey It was the Center. second one With the Yeah The guy Yeah You lost me with the bees <laughs> That's it Giant I don't bees, know what the fuck bro, I ain't going outside for shit Giant <laughs> butterflies <laughs> And uh, dragonflies And stuff like that bro, Mosquitoes I'm, I'm gonna keep that thing on me <laughs> Bro Something that kills <laughs> <The> pump, <laughs> pump on my back <laughs> What are you talking about Big ass bees bro What Mosquito bro Yo. That shit gonna be scary as fuck. Buddy. That shit will kill you in one place, <laughs> bro. What? <laughs> Suck your whole. Bro, a lot of them out. shits would be so scary, bro. Deadly too. Prey mantis. Centip- a centipede. Stink bug. Centipede. So much shit. Uh, so much shit. Them shits. A cockroach. A giant skunk. See those become big too, right? Oh my god. <laughs> a giant rat. Oh, oh I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, I've already yeah. seen enough giant rats <laughs> yeah. in New York in the Brooklyn nah, we talking subway. About car size. I know, and so I'm saying I've seen enough of those to not want to mess with them. Now you super size it. And rats eat anything too, bro. They'll eat so you. imagine a big one. Oh, that should eat in everything, everything. in anything. A car, they'll eat everything. <clears throat> so they eat through walls. They eat through everything. Oh my that's god, they can walk on walls they too, gonna, like Spider Man. Yeah. They fit through anything too. It's yeah. like their bodies, like. But I mean, if they're that big, it'll be hard for them to fit through stuff. But still, they'll be able to. Yeah. You know what I mean? So what would be a cool pet that was big and then small? You know, like elephant. how you said it, elephant. Eh. Uh, yeah. Elephant. Uh, Motherfuckers are smart. I mean, so what would happen with a lion? Would a lion just become a cat, or like what happens with a lion? Does it become smaller, or does it stay the same since it's already a medium so sized? I, I think it would stay the same because it's medium. I mean, they're large. They're, they're not they're, medium. They're yeah, large. They're no, like compared to us, they're like the same size. Yeah. They're not the fucking. What would I have, bro? That's a good question. What would I have, bro? I'll have a bird. A giant hummingbird? A, a giant bird, bro. Oh, so you could, could have something giant, not something that's big then small. No, yeah, I if it's a, small, it goes big. I'm, yeah, if it's I'm, big, I, it goes small. I would have a giant medium. bird for sure, though. It's like a ride and fly around. So, like, whether it's an eagle or a. Something, something. It has to be some some, some type of bird that's going to, or falcon or something like that. And yeah. I'll when I'm gone, that'd be like like Lord of the Rings. Until a wasp comes and snatch you out the sky. A wasp? Nah, the, 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 the bird should be bigger than the wasp. So what about something big and small? Um, what would be cool? A hippo. I, you know, hippo came to my mind. You know, a rhino. A rhino. A rhino, hippo, elephant, those are all good ones. A rhino would be Crazy. Um, That'd be dangerous. A whale, a giraffe. Yeah. I get a nice I was, whale. I, was that, but, um, no, I, was like, yeah. I get a whale. Nah, I'm okay on a whale. Like that whale, like shark. Something. I was thinking a shark when you when he said whale, I was like shark. Eh. No, they still I want a shark. Anyways, I don't want stuff that's like swimming. I don't want a fish. It's just gonna be a goldfish at that point. Yeah. Kill a whale sized goldfish though. Whoosh. Yeah, that's kind of cool. Yeah. I'm teaching the gold thing. I, I need it. I'll be like, okay, Jill. So you saying like the jaguars and stuff like that? They're gonna be the same size. They have to get smaller. What jaguars? Like, like all yeah, like those cats and stuff. They gotta get a little bit small. They gotta become like house cat size. I, I guess. You know what I mean? And then house cats become big cat size. You God know? damn! 
That's that's why I just left a medium. That should be crazy. That would be <laughs> wild. Imagine having a dog or the size dog of Clifford. Was, I would have. A, I would definitely have a dog that's. Yeah, but, but that's it'd be hard to train uh, them. Yeah, the size yeah. of and stuff like that. The size of Clifford. One oh month, God. it's already the size of you and shit. God the fuck? damn. You already know what it is. It's your boy Elijah from the Pip Company, and I had to let you know that we got some new drip on the website. Go to thepipcompany.com. We just got some new gear in. We had the new drop from, you know what I'm saying, the superior to the average collection. Go and get that. As you can see, I got that 420 green on. You heard? Listen, go and get some new drip on the site. You know, it's we got some we got some nice things out there for you guys. You feel me? We got some nice things. Go and check it out. Thepipcompany.com. And I'll see you over there. Peace. But yeah, I don't know, man. A dog, that too much, that be, too much doodle. Yeah. That it'd be huge. Just right. you didn't even clean that up, bro. How the fuck you about to clean it up? You know what I'm saying? Nah. <laughs> Shit size of me, bigger than me and shit. All right. <laughs> fuck out of here. I don't know, bro. That, that'd be. You gotta go to a designated area. But then again, it. it'd probably only be like the size of a of like a, a, a elephant. An elephant's dung isn't huge or what? massive like that. So, if that are the case... You ever been to the zoo, friend? I've been to the zoo. No, I'm elephant, baby. It's big, but it's not as big that as area. you. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They got a little stench out there. Oh, though. it's stink. It's like the like oh. the horses in Boston, right? Imagine having to clean that shit as a job. Man. You remember our photo shoot? When fat ass shit, shit's in the middle? Yeah. That shit like a speed bump for the car, dude. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> that shit. Fuck. Uh, that's hey, nasty. Man. But them bugs and stuff like that, that's the yeah. biggest issue. And yeah, I don't biggest. Know, I, can't, I can't live in a world like that. Mm -hmm. Especially with I don't know. 20 feet mosquitoes flying around. Oh, Imagine a dragonfly. Scary, They'd probably be eating the mosquitoes like crazy. Uh, spiders. Oh, forget it. No, bro. Forget it. Oh, yeah, God. we're done. We're done. All right, guys. You uh, you let us know what big animal would you have as a pet that can become small? What small animal would you have as a pet that becomes big? Yeah. What what bugs and stuff are you afraid of? Or do you are you not afraid of bugs? Do you are you a bug master? You let us know in the comments below. Um, but yeah, that's 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 pretty much it. That's our non-smoking smoke break you know what i'm saying our smoke break with the break from the smoke yeah break. man yeah man. <laughs> yeah man so on a not right. so high note <laughs> on a <laughs> free so. britney grinder man yeah yeah man. that's it free her and shout out to tiara mac <laughs> Man, you got a vote coming Yo. soon. Boy. You got a vote coming soon. Shout yeah. out to Tiana. Hey, listen, man. I'm just saying, she was moving that thing, okay? <laughs> All right, look. <laughs> listen, ladies and gentlemen, as always, listen, if you're new here, subscribe. This Yo. is, um, you know, our 58th episode, 59th episode. 59, so 59. go check out all of our past ones. Stay tuned because we got a lot more content. We just dropped a vlog in Martha's Vineyard. Shout out to okay. Real Never Fades. Yep. I also want to shout out to Donkey Bongs TV yep. for powering this episode. And... Um, Go to the website. Go to thepiffcompany.com. Go get you some merch, thepiffcompany.com. Uh, like I said, go get some superior to the average gear. Yep. Um, if you're listening to us on Spotify, come to YouTube. If you're on YouTube and you want to listen to us on Spotify, go to Spotify. We there anyway. Run them numbers up. We you know here, what I'm baby. You know what I'm saying? Hit that bell. Hit, Hit that the bell. bell. Get them notifications popping up. Share with your friends. Let's grow this channel, guys. Let's, let's be a community. Let's For grow sure. this For together. Sure. Let's grow this as far and as big as we can. The further we reach, the more we can do. Yeah. So, thank you guys. And as always, till next time, baby. Peace. Peace. The Piff Company. Deuces. Yeah, man. All right. Can we go smoke now? Huh? Fucking A. They can keep talking. I'ma keep popping. Rockin' this pimp, not no robin' Now they lovin' the way that I'm saucin' We superior to average, no top ten We gon' come in and chain up the topic We playin' chess, I know checkers We movin' strategic, we not movin' this This ain't no regular We doin' numbers, I'm really a hell yeah Ain't never heard of ya Pull out a gang gang in this bitch So you know we superior huh? Yeah, bitch to the average You don't need for that kind of foul language, right? <laughs>